welcome to Waypoint Survival. Today, I want to show you an amazing mini striker hack. Stay tuned. To do this little hack, you're going to need this mini striker, which comes in this waterproof container. You don't have to use this if you don't want to, because this fits really well in a mini Altoids tin. You're also going to need about three feet or one meter of jute, uh, just a small jute cord, and then a small block of beeswax. The first thing you're going to do is you're going to take your small length of jute and unroll it, and then using the block of beeswax, you're going to start pulling it across, just like this. And what we're doing is we're waxing the line. And you'll do that multiple times with the whole length. It doesn't take a whole lot of time to do this, but do it until the entire line is nicely waxed. Next, we look at this mini striker and we see that it's square on the top and the bottom with a little bit of a indent here for the barrel. And of course this comes with extra flints and you just unscrew it at the bottom to replace them. So it's a pretty handy little mechanism. And what we're going to do is we're going to take this and we're just going to wind this around this barrel very carefully all the way around till we get to the top. I'll do that and get back with you. When you're done, it'll look something like this. And because it's waxed, it will stick to itself so you don't have to tape it to keep it on there. So once you get it wrapped up like this, of course, it stores really well even in a mini Altoids kit. It's just a perfect mini fire striker starter for that. But let's show you how to light it. First, you want to unwind a significant length of it. Oh, well, maybe three or four inches. Just like this. And then, take our pocket knife and we want to fluff up the end of it. Just scrape it like this. After you get a sufficient amount scraped up, we have a nice little tinder bowl on the end of the wax jute. Lay it down, pull out enough cord where it can lay nicely, and then holding it with the other hand, you want to strike it using your finger like this. And there we go. Lights pretty well, and being that it's waxed, it's going to burn quite a long time, like a little candle, enough for you to go ahead and get your fire started and you've got enough length here that you can go ahead and stick it in your fire and get it going. This is James Bender for Waypoint Survival. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Also make sure and check out the links in the description box below, just under the down arrow. And while you're down there, you'll also find our waypointsurvival.com link. And this is where you can sign up to take great survival and bushcraft training classes here at our beautiful facility in Southern Ohio. And if you haven't done so already, please subscribe to the channel. We'd really appreciate it. And when you do subscribe, make sure and press that bell button so that you can stay notified of all of our upcoming videos. And we'll talk to you next time.